We're gonna be talking about how to protect your house. And that was just a blooper I just showed you. I want you to, I want you to listen closely. Hmm. Nerd time. So basically, if you hear a crunch under your doormat or something like that, or you, I'm gonna talk about this in my TikTok. If you if you already listened to it and you follow me on TikTok, cool. But if you did, do it. You don't have to. Please do. I need to follow me. Anyway, if you hear a crunch under, look under uh, under there. But if it's like a chip or a cookie or a cracker or something like that, don't c call the authorities. Right, call. Call the authorities because it's probably a robber putting it right there to see if you're there. I'll wait a couple of days, and if it's not cracked, then that means it that that means you didn't go. You're not in your house, so that, so he would go inside. But if it was, he would he he would have to make a plan that requires you to be inside your house. Okay, so call the authorities right then and there. Also, if you see something tied against your car, like if you see something tied against your car or something like that, or string tied against someone's car or your car, you're going to want to call the authorities because that's someone trying to kidnap you, and, and, and they're going to be looking for that. They're going to be looking for that string all over, and they're going to be spying at you. Oh, and if you see one person inside of the car right next to you, and... Try, if you see one person in the car, in the driver's seat, try to um see, like, try to look in the back seat to see if it has any kids or try to look in the next um, um, seat. I'm sorry. Try to look in the next seat, but not too suspiciously. Just, like, glare when you're walking by and act like, oh, I forgot my phone. And you go back, but no, I think I have it. And you just try to go back and forth and look or, and, and suspiciously look. If it looks like someone else was in that seat, then it will, it will be safe. Oh, and make sure you get a door. I, I forgot to finish the one. If you see something tied around the doorknob of your car, make sure you call or someone else's. Make sure you either get as many people, like get as many friends as you can. Like call, call. Call your friends, call your mom, call your ex-boyfriend, call your ex-girlfriend, call your call your dad, call all everyone you know. And if you don't know, and if you don't really know that many people, just call the authorities and tell them what happened. On to the next one. If you see funny writing that looks like a gang sign, m m make sure you call the authorities right then because it's because it's someone, um, it's someone like it's it's called a tag. It's someone no, it's some, it's someone telling the other robbers oh this house is where we're going to get now when they're looking i'm sorry this is right here when, when they're looking around and that would tell them when it's kind of like the cookie just you won't just you will only be able to see it you won't really be able to hear it or if you see someone writing or spray painting or writing with chalk especially like on your car on your house on the ground and you might want to have a daily you might want to have a daily thing, like a, like every day you check around your house. And if you live in an apartment, check check around your apartment. Like check around the walls of your apartment. Tr try to check around the walls of your apartment. Oh, and also like, if you have a truck, you, you could pull your and and you don't want someone and either, because someone could just break the window. I mean, not break the window, but. Someone could easily, it, if, if your car doesn't lock or your truck doesn't lock, put the seatbelt. And if you have this little loop thing right there, you, you put it like that. Then you tie, and you tie it and then you click it right here. And then you try to lock your seat by going back and forth, back, back and forth, like, mm, 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 you know, and then go to sleep. But try to block the windows as much as you can because someone, especially if you're going to sleep in a semi truck. Try to block the windows with whatever you have, so no one could just be staring at you. Like, and I know, I know it's kind of scary, but it's so no one will be staring at you from like, they can climb up, they can climb up the top. Like it goes like this, window, 
and then that they can climb up there, get up there and look at you, or they can climb up one of those sides and look at you. Oh, and also if you have that if and also if you have that kind of truck that can look behind, make sure you try to make sure you try to take that as your advantage because you will want to be able to see behind you to see if anyone's plotting around the truck or just same thing if someone writes something suspicious on your truck like writes a um, note or something like that or I'm gonna kill you call the authorities right now try as much as you can to get to where a bunch of people are like try to drive where like try to drive inside the highway and try to drive in the middle lane and not in the fort not in this lane either this lane where it has a little divider or the middle lane but not that lane someone can just jump you from inside the forest even though that's very unlikely because your car is way too fast anyway if someone pops your tires I, I want you to lock the doors cover your windows and call the authorities try not to panic or make too much noise and and and, and if you're near anyone's like your friend's house make sure you make sure you if you can call the authorities then call your friend to come and pick you up and, and especially if it's nighttime at nighttime you might not want to call your friend to pick you up because that be because at least like you don't want to call your friend or friends to come maybe if you had more than one friends and they more than one friend coming as like friends that sleep together stuff like that i'm not talking about sleeping to men like you know how all those YouTubers have the people, like, in different parts of the house, they're different gaming areas, and they they live in that house? Yeah, kind of like that, if you have gaming friends or something like that. And or especially, I don't really have any YouTuber friends, but if you have YouTuber friends, well, my one of my cousins are, is a YouTuber. I'm, I might check out his channel. I, I don't really know his name, but one in one of my videos, I'm going to try to mention him. And I don't know... I'm going to give him a shout out. Anyway, here's another one. If someone's following behind you, try, okay, if someone's following behind you, try to um, first try, first try to go in a circle, like trying to go in a tr triangle. So basically, if you go this way, then try to go that way. So basically, if you take a straight left, wait, no, straight left, right, right, right 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 you should be able to go like let's see left 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 so basically if you try to take this so basically you want to try to go in a square like that 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 trying to go around and and if she's still behind you try patting your pockets so basically you're gonna have to try to either pat your pockets pat your pockets oh darn it I, for, I forgot my phone or my wallet or something like that but, but if you have a bunch of stuff in your pockets um try to like call a friend and um, make sure you don't talk that loud it depends how close he is to you and then try picking up your pace a little, and, and try, try try picking up your pace a little. And, but um, but 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 if he fast, so basically, act like you're texting, but you're actually taking a video of behind you. Act like you're texting, and you're actually taking a video of behind you, and 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 then you walk faster, um, and 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 then you walk faster, and if he fixes his pace try to call your friend but not too loud or something like that or if you see someone right next to you or someone else close to you make sure they make sure they look normal and they don't look like they're trying to cover up their face so if they're wearing a hoodie try to dodge that person try to go another way to if you can't do that then i'm gonna want you to stop and I, I'm, I'm gonna want you to stop I'm, and, and, and then if you have a weapon on you, you like a knife or a gun, but, but if you don't have that on you, then you wanna keep going, then you, if, if there's a way you could turn, you could cross the street and try to call your friend to come, try, try to call the authorities and tell them where you're gonna be headed.
tr try to call the authorities and tell them where are you going to be headed where are you going to be headed and then they'll meet you there like and also if you and and especially go inside of a restaurant then i want you then i want you to go in the bath so then i want you to not go in the bathroom but go go inside of like try to get a space next to you but then pretend something spilled in your seat and you go over there then if they follow you then then, then ask them stop following me it, it, stop following yourself if they are then 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 um then, then notify the cash register that they're following you and and make the cash register order to get them if he pulls the gun then i'm gonna want you to put him down if he pats your pockets then just do whatever it says and tell at uh, try, try to do whatever he says then take a then look for an exit be, be, before all that happens look for exit right when you get there and go out the exit then come back then if he's right there run at him and, and then walk at him walk forward to him and then if he buds you and stops you from going, you push him out. Make sure he doesn't have any weapons. Look to make his po if his pockets is bolded out. If if any part of his body is just bolded out, I I want you to call nine one one in front of me. If he holds you if he holds you hostage, then I would want you. If he holds you hostage with duct bu duct tape, you're gonna have to do this and. Like, <clears throat> And then you're gonna wanna have to go out of the exit, then call the police, then tell them where you are and wh and that you're behind, and try to call and and at the same time call and after that call your friend to pick you up. And then once that happens, you should go inside. The cops should already. Th there should be two sets of cops coming because um the robbery and and all that stuff. And there should be two cops call, and and if no one else called the cops, then then make sure you do. Once you're out there, and try and try to hide like. You know when you go right there, go to the whole entire other side, and then go and sit on that corner and call the cops, and then while while you're calling the cops, you can, you you and, and then while you're call, calling the cops, you might wanna um, call like your mom, your dad, or whoever. Is close. Your friends are close to you, but if none of your friends are close to you, um, tr but if none of your friends are a distance, um, c close to you enough, then you just call the cops, and you ask them how long till they get there, and and if they say anything longer than thirty minutes, you 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 you're gonna say what direction are you in, and, and then you're gonna want to walk that direction, and 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 then I want you to. Talk, be talking to him the whole entire way you're walking the direction in case you see anything else that's sus. Okay? And then once you and 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 also and also make sure you alert to get another set of police because there's other if, if there's other people at that restaurant. But if you couldn't really find a restaurant, you could find anywhere else and do that stuff. But if but if all the restaurants were closed near you, I, I, I would want you to walk towards the way that the cops would say they were going. Then, then, then I want you to meet them there. Then, once the cops come, um, t t tell them to give you a signal. And, and, and then once they give you that signal, you'll start running. You you start picking up your pace. And, 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 and then pick it up, pick it up slowly, 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 slowly. Pick up your pace until you start running. And then run to the cops. And then the cops will protect you. Okay, that was kind of what fourteen minutes. That's pretty long. Oh, and also make sure if make sure to lock your doors, lock your doors, lock your doors, lock your windows. And if someone's standing, oh, oh, and and if you see someone standing outside of your house with where 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 there's a window, try to go in a part of your house where it doesn't have any windows. Lock the door and put a bunch of stuff against the door, and then call the and then call. Well, lock, lock the door to your house and all the windows, and then lock that door and board so it'll be on your obstacle to take it out to take them out.
Oh, and also if you have one of those pass word doors you can you don't answer the door um do all this stuff i said lock your door and make sure your make sure if your doors have windows try to not if your door has a window on it try to not to avoid that window but if you can't you might just want to lock in front of him and put stuff against that door then lock all the other doors and windows and then you want to go in that bathroom, and you, you should have been calling the police when you're locking your doors. And then you should go in there, lock, lock the door, put stuff boarded against it. And if you can't, take something in there to board it up with. And then once the police get there, once the police get there, um, make sure you describe what he looks like while the police are coming. And make sure you um, call the fire department, too. That is it. I want you to like, subscribe, see the rest of my videos, and I just farted. Oh, that sounds so random and disgusting at the same time. Why did I say that out loud? Why did I say that? Anyway, I want you to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you'll be able to see more videos like this today. And I want you to. Put in the comments down below if you want me to start a new channel. And what do you want me to put in that channel? But the limit is five channels. like Because it's already hard to manage one channel. And also I'm going to be starting a business where I can sell toys. So if you have any little ones, you see, you, you know friends that have little ones. You have, you, you have a little sibling that's a little one. Or, or you just like collecting toy, toys. Or you know other people that collect toys. Whatever works try to go to my business i re i'm gonna tell you my business i haven't made it but i'm gonna make it just try to go to my business once i make it i'm gonna tell you when it's probably gonna be next i'll probably finish it next week i'll probably finish i'll probably finish it like next week and it is the reason why i can make so many videos is because it's summer 2022 2023 me hello i hope you watch this video and like subscribe and bye Yeet.